So uh, good evening to all the wonderful people who are present here. So I want to talk about the talent gateway and basically my journey, uh, how I uh, changed from like the first semester to the fourth semester and like uh, how being a graduate student uh, from India, like uh, how I changed totally from the starting. So um, I'll be uh, talking about myself first. So I, my hometown is from Mysore. Karnataka, which is based in India, and uh, my hobbies are socializing, watching documentaries on YouTube, playing sports like soccer, hockey, and also like gaming. And my education. So basically, I did my bachelor's in mechatronics engineering, and uh, I'm currently pursuing masters in industrial manufacturing and systems engineering. So uh, my work. So I was as a team lead in Akshaya Machine Tools, and I also uh, was like the business and logistic lead for uh, the team Argon at Intelligent Systems Club. I summer interned in a company called Glotronics Private Limited recently, and uh, I'm also the talent ambassador. I'm a part of various organizations. So I'll also be talking about the various organizations which I'm a part of. So. Um, so how it all started? So I was in my first semester. I was concentrating on just getting my scholarship. That's how, like, usually the graduate students do. Coming from India, all I wanted to get was like get a GPA more than 3.2 and get a scholarship. So I met my friend Nihal, who is also presenting here. He introduced me to Talent Gateway. Just how I introduced to Aniruddha, who is also presenting here. It's like a chain of events. So, and it's good to see all three of us who are present here. And uh, so second semester of my university, so I met Nihal in the campus shuttle and I asked him like, what are you doing? And uh, he was like, I'm um, participating in the challenges of the talent gateway. And um, I asked him like, what challenges are you doing? So like he called me that evening and he told me about the talent gateway and like how it is fun to do. And uh, I asked him more about the challenges and uh, he told me to contact Karthika Gupati, who's also a previous M talent candidate. So they told me more about what the talent gateway is all about. And uh, Talent Gateway led me to all the societies and organizations which I'm a part of right now. So I want to mention about the societies which I'm a part of. So Society of Hispanic Professional Engineers, and Intelligence Systems Club, Indian Graduate Student Association, Circle K International, Graduate Student International Organization, and Talent Gateway. So I'll be talking about briefly about these organizations and what I gained through it. So the ship. What I gained through it is to impact the world through STEM awareness, access, support, and development. So they are one of the professional organizations on campus which will help you develop, grow as a student. And ISC. So in, with being uh, the business and logistic lead for the intelligence system club and also having a background in mechatronics engineering, I definitely wanted to work on robotics. And ISC provided me with an opportunity to work and program the autonomous robots. And the Circle K International. So my mother is a social worker. So she always used to tell me that uh, education and fun, everything is like a part of life. But you need to impact the society. And how do you do that? Like social work is God's work. So I joined Circle K, who also work with uh, helping hands. So I did a volunteering event in uh, the Farmington Hills, where I packed foods and clothes for civilian refugees and kids back in uh, Iraq. So that made me feel that like I should be thankful for everything I have in life. And IGSA, so IGSA, they are literally like the family. They help you with the orientation, like the day you land in US, and also tell you about like how to get jobs and how it is going to be being an international student. So the impact of Talent Gateway, so it has made me more career ready, and it has made me like have the teamwork skills and the improved communication skills, as well as like being more involved in campus. And the achievements to Talent Gateway. The talent gateway was really addictive to me because like coming from India, I did not know how the American education system works. So being in talent gateway and uh, doing the challenges, I completely got addicted to it because I love games. And like as soon as I used to submit like five to 10 challenges in the night and I used to see that I used to get points in the morning. So I was the highest point getter in January, February and March till I got my M talent designation. And uh, finally all this journey led me to be a talent ambassador so what I mainly gain through Talent Ambassador is using your life experience and talking to the student community and also helping serve the student community, talking to them about what you basically gained being in the Talent Gateway. And I'm literally privileged to be a part of Talent Gateway and work as a Talent Ambassador on the campus. So I did a lot of pop-up events with the Talent Gateway, talking to a lot of students on campus and talking to them about my journey and uh, how even if I can do it, definitely you can do it too. And I want to thank uh, Laurie and Joshua for providing me with this opportunity 
to present and also for uh, trusting me and electing me as a talent ambassador. And I want to end this with my favorite challenge which I had in the Talent Gateway. It is definitely your favorite quote. And my, I have two favorite quotes which is from my favorite series called Suits. So one will be, <laughs> One will be the difference between you and me is you want to lose small and I want to win big. And the second one will be ever love someone so much you would do anything for them. Well, make that someone yourself and do whatever you want to. What I want to end this is like trust yourself and uh, be confident in yourself and I'm pretty sure like and love yourself and I'm pretty sure like you can achieve whatever you plan to do.